check it out. You might remember a few videos ago I made ribeye steak. So here's something I made with the leftovers. Once the Canton style noodles are going, you want to rinse them. Finish cooking the shrimp. Now throw in some garlic and some green onions or scallions. Cook that for a minute. Then throw in some already shredded cabbage, coleslaw mix. Now throw in sliced up steak. And there's also some mushrooms in there. Notice I had pulled out the cabbage mix. Saute that up. Let the fat render out and crisp up. Now throw in your canton noodles. Always make sure to season with salt and pepper. A little char is good on the noodles. So leave it alone in the pan. Let it get some color. Now Time to bring them together. Add your veggies and shrimp mix. Now add your flavoring. We got here some of that Roy Choi Korean barbecue sauce. Got some nice sweetness there. You can add some saltiness with the soy sauce. And that was always about balance, so just a tiny little splash of rice vinegar. And we got some more sweetness with some mirin. Now you wanna toss it up, mix it up. Get all those flavors mixed in carefully. Don't wanna lose any of the ingredients. If you have a wok, use it. You can use the extra space. Let all the flavors come together for another 30 seconds or so. You don't want the vegetables to overcook or anything. So I got it on high heat here. It's all gonna come together pretty quick. Just wanna get that sauce mixed in, cooked into the noodles, into the veggies, the meat. last thing that you want to do before turning off the heat is throw in some green onions, mix that in, now turn off the heat. And then finish it with some toasted sesame oil. Then toss it together. Ah, oh, the smell. Now you can plate it up. Make sure you get some beef, some shrimp, some, some of everything. I was in a hurry, so I didn't remove the tails on the shrimp. Again, this is a midweek meal. And... It was a quick dinner, quick, easy, and delicious.